Lasagna. I I like lasagna. I like plain lasagna. Have you ever had plain lasagna? It's really nice. I'm one of these people that actually don't mind plain food. I look forward to it when the meal comes. The only part of the plain food I didn't like last time was the dessert. It was like some weird coffee sort of cake and it tasted foul. And I was hungry, but I couldn't eat it. It just wasn't nice. But to be fair, I don't like coffee, so... I think there was no chance of me liking that cake. If only they just didn't make it anything to do with coffee, we would have been okay. We got Huntress, we got Fiends, we got Dryads. That's all very good tier one. If you can call a Dryad tier one. You can do what you like, Balador, Balador. But bear in mind that you are part of a team. You are representative of this game. Do not fail us. I'll chuck down a Huntress so there's a chance. I might be able to get control of the middle, but I'm not sure. This is an auto battle map. You have two teams of three against each other, PvP. You basically place down units and you hope to counter the units that you're going up against. For example, a Huntress should be able to beat a Footman, so we should be able to get control of the middle. I'm also typically always going for that first hero, but I think if you go for a first hero in red spot, you have to not build any units, so I don't know. The hero can always wait. And I can always get more Huntress for now. So, triple mine. I'm in a power position. Three footmen from ping. What have you got? Alright. You got one sorceress versus three footmen. That should be uh, interesting. She might be able to slow at least a couple of them. One more slow? No, not going to get it. She's not going to do it. I got 40 seconds until my send. The next send, though, is from Balador in four seconds. Two, one. And it's nothing. Our poor tower is like, guys. Guys, where's the support? Don't forget your gold mines if you're trying to get those. Can't do your strat unless you're covered. Direct strike mix again for good measure, XD. You realize you already requested that before, Oti. Like, this is requested from Garfield. Hang on a second. I'm getting distracted by you guys. Oh, wow. Prison Lane is a good pick. He's not going to get any experience. You requested it afterwards, and now you requested another one. So, bloody how many direct strikes? There's going to be like 15 direct strikes. Not quite, but you know. Alright, Huntress. Let's get it done. I'll probably beat that. Maybe. I don't know. Probably not, maybe. Oh, maybe. Especially since the higher health. Nah, you won't get it. I want this gold mine. Hurry up. Satch. Chichos going to get the experience there. But we're still getting the gold for the time being because my Huntress is hanging in there. Give it just a little bit of extra gold. Those raiders should be interesting when they charge up on the tower. That's kind of good. They snuck by most of it. Ah, oh, unlucky. They got pulled by the footman. Well, I got a bunch of team killers in my team. Let's hope the games don't go too one-sided. It's all right. Raiders are good versus Dryad, so at least you got control. It's too late for me to get my hero in time, so it's still going to be Miss Huntresses. For now. I got my triple gold mine. That'll be me sorted for a while. Uh-oh. What are you selling for? Oh, you're replacing. Okay. Don't ever sell. God damn, he really did get to tier 3 quick, didn't he? And away we go. Can't wait to see what my hero is going to be. They can build Spirit Walker, Priest. Oh, that's really good. Get some Priests when you can get them. They're super nice. Ah, will Huntresses actually lose this? 
It looks like they will. See, people say, oh, you should just skip the hero and go for the um, units. But the Huntress actually lost. It's a footman. It's a freaking footman and a hero. That's disgraceful, right? Well, when I throw my hero into the mix, they definitely won't lose. I'm hoping the Sork is going to pull the units, but he's split the units now. Imagine losing to Footman with Huntresses. That's crazy. These guys are probably going to get caught by the next player before they get to hit the tower. They might get to hit the tower for a few seconds. Let's hope. Quick! You're not going to get a hit along. You're actually getting pillaged from that. Yeah, I suppose if you get through, yeah. Four hits, it was all worth it. Right, what's my hero going to be? Aha! That's funny. Well, since there's footman, we'll go cone of finger magic. I'll get some dryads for slow. It's that patch where the siege engines can attack units. This should be easy experience for me. If that tank's actually going to... Maybe not. Maybe... Maybe... I hope it doesn't kill the priestess. Good, I get the experience. I'll take it, boys. There's no way I'm going to lose this fight. You can bugger off if I'm going to lose this. There's one. Get it done. Girls, get it done. 66 seconds until my next roll. I don't desperately need anything from the tier. I think my riders are really good though. It's got a lot of units though. It's got rifles. That's nasty. Pit Lord's a bloody good hero. They got quite fortunate with that. Oh, Warden, not so good. You might want to pick Blink, honestly. As your oh, nice. Well done. Oh, it keeps the Warden alive longer. Job's done. Mana Shield and Sea Bitch is OP early game. Yeah, maybe, actually. Because she doesn't probably use all our mana properly. Looks like I'm going to need a bit of an army to fight against all of this. I'm going to pull this back a little bit. Because I don't want the squishy uh, Huntresses getting hit by the ranged. Oh, you're actually keeping them busy. I'm surprised. Okay, I thought they'd be at the tower by now. I'm glad I made that decision. Although the Huntresses are running in roughly about the right speed. There we go. See, the Fiend can take the hit. Look at that micro. Gonna take down two armies, boys. See, yeah, she's got enough mana. I think you could get away with mana shield. Can always turn it on and off. A bit like when I took the wind walk on the Blade Master, which was definitely the right decision. Even though some people said it wasn't, but some did. And the people that said it was the right decision were correct. Because the wind walk kept my Blade Master alive for a lot longer. And allowed him to level up, which allowed it to be stronger. Friendship. Are they team friendship again? Chichoff, Ping and Tyrell. May as well be. Keep going, Missy. Look at that cleave value. Good job with the priests, at least. Those priests are OP. I could even get more teams, to be honest. I can see what we're up against. I don't think we're losing. We had a rough, rocky start, but we're pushing it now. Look at that, level 3, because of that micro I did earlier. And that hero. Ah, uh, I couldn't get the Mort teams in time. Just tanked. I might take up again and go Hippo Riders. Those are also just really good.
Nah, not fourth gold mine. I don't think you ever bother getting fourth gold mine. Nice. Is she still going? She's been in the fight for. Ah, oh, she almost hung in there. Look at that damage suddenly. My units are coming back. We're getting those hits in, boys. Go, go, go. Could get fairy dragons if they behave, but most likely just get those hippo riders. We'll go with those for now. For now. Time to take a look at the skins. Now I got quite a few credits. I don't think I've ever bought any skins in this game. What's the default footman skin? You make him a captain. So the cheapest skins are 50. So I always wanted to kind of save up for the big ones, to be honest. But considering we play this map a fair bit, but you'd be out of money after you bought like four of the bigger ones. So it just ain't going to be worth it. It's just nice to have variety and to see different models running in. I think that looks good. Hang on a second. I've got to remove this for a second and get one more hippo rider. There we go. Thank you. Okay. Yeah. Well, you can either do it on, like, your favorite unit, like, or a hero, but I think you're better off actually just getting the cheap ones, because it's just, it's just something different. Although, to be fair, the footman is pointless. Those look so similar to the basic footman, I don't think they're worth it. So the footman can stay as they are, plus footmen suck. So then you look for the other... You see, that one's a bit more different. It's still quite similar, of course. Yeah, he's done it to make it... Oh, that one looks really cool. That's definitely different. Dark Iron, there you go. That's a true. Oh, the Night Up one looks so freaking funny, though. And the Goblin one. I actually can't think the Night Up one looks funnier. The Pirate Man's obviously cool. But we'll get the Dark Iron. Maybe I should just do it for the ones I've got at the moment. Yeah, buy the 50 one. Silver ones for variety. I agree, that's what I mean. Because it's so costly. She's got the biggest tier. This one looks really good, though. I like this one. Inquisitors, kind of cool. Chrome. I actually quite like the uh, Karma one, to be honest. She looks quite good, honestly. As you don't see too many um, black skin uh, Warcraft 3 models, and it actually looks quite fitting. So I'm going to go with that. Yeah, I kind of get like a Diablo 5 from that, like Diablo 2. Yo, Kit and I recently got a scholarship. Oh. You really helped me through the hard times, so I think you deserve part of it. So anyways, oh. I think I have four requests in the bank now. <laughs> I see. It always comes at a cost, doesn't it, Windelin, eh? Thank you very much. Well, we'll see what your trash requests will be in time. Congrats. How's the uh, priest? Uh, she's stuck at level 3. Although this could be her time to get level 4. Can she do it? Oh, she's not going to do it unless she gets that mana shield kicking. Oh, you walked out a bit late, but she did manage to get it. But no, even then, just not quite enough. So she's not going to get level 4. Oof. That's a lot of bars. I think we've just got to carry on messing these. I'll have to upgrade army damage as well soon. Has Crowville used up all of his requests? No. But he doesn't have as many as he thinks he does. I don't think he's ever going to get around to using them all anyway, so... He's too distracted with his comics. We won't tell him. Yeah, that sorceress one looks cool. High Elf, the priests... Those... that one... At least it's you don't ever get to play that. That's a creep. High Elf stands out. That's like the old school priest. That's the priest in Reign of Chaos. But I don't know if it's different enough for me to 
sorry, um, one of them is. I suppose that one looks kind of cool, but... Let's do damage, sorry. They're gonna lose the tower! Alright, let's get some experience, boys. Let's get some experience. I don't know if she goes, needs to go level 2 mana shield. Maybe. Fuck it. I don't think the cone... The frost tower helps that much. I'm not going to win this fight, though, now. I'm going to get completely overwhelmed. I'll get a witch doctor and healing wards. But honestly, the best thing I can do is just carry on massing hippo riders. Because I don't have good enough ground. I don't have good enough sort of anti heavy armor with the form of frost worms or chimeras or anything like that. My tier 1 stuff was good, but anything past that point is pretty mediocre to be honest with you. I think it's way better just to... Yeah, I can get the casters and then that's probably just steel hippo riders after that. Knights are okay. They can buy a bit of time if I need. Did I disable the mana shield? I don't remember clicking that. Maybe I did that because I was clicking the ability. That, oh, I've done that before, haven't I? Yep, I remember now. I clicked the uh, thing on the ultimate or something one time. Yeah, for some reason, intuitively, I go for that. Rather than the top left bit. Archmage is good. I'm wondering whether to get a second hero, actually. She's not going to be too far off level 5 and then into 6. Tornado's not that good, but it is pretty good for theirs. Particularly, we've got a lot of ranged. So I can snipe stuff quickly. Hippo Rider versus Chicha. I'm going to lose my hero way quicker. Interesting choice from my Hippo Riders. Huh? I wonder. I need to get the upgrade. That's what I'm missing. I wonder what that choice was from them. That seemed a bit odd. Maybe I need a bit more burst damage. So I'm going to have to bring the Necromancers into play. We need the tanks for, but the chimeras are good at least. Get her some items. You could. I think she's going to get level 5 to 6 pretty easily without the items, though, so I want to keep prioritizing army for snowball for when we fight back. Where's me Necromancer? There we go. Got Unholy Frenzy. I think that's all I need, really. I'll get the Dryad Abolish as well. Time for a bit of a snowball. Bit of a shame, my hippo riders are obsessed with hitting this hero that gets rejuve on it. So I can't tell the AI to go for the chimeras, which is what they should be going for. They're ignoring the DPS. But I don't have any NT yet, well I got bats. Bats aren't they're bloody expensive. It's two hundred gold for a unit that's gonna blow up and do five hundred damage. What? If it's five hundred damage, how much damage does it do for a chimera? You normally need like three bats for a chimera. It's looking a bit steamrolly at the moment now for them. I'm honestly not sure what I can... Maybe Fiends? Web the Chimeras? And I hope that I can snipe them.
That Archmage has leveled up quick. Yeah, I think we go for the Fiends, boys, and hope. Hope that those Chimeras get taken down. It's going to be easy units for me to kill in a second. Time to build up some unholy frenzy. Go necromancers, go. May have to get some knights. Got a web and a chimera, it stops them attacking as efficiently, so that's better. Still can't win this fight though. Just doesn't go well for me. I got healing wards on my witch doctors. Strong guard, that's not bad. For 50 gold. It's something a bit different. I think I'll do all the 50 gold ones. I like the ones with the, the hammer though. Garifoss is obviously pin pin, but the one with the hammer is bloody good, that is. Just because it's the hammer. I think we have to go for a second hero. Griffs were good from my last experience of playing. Good blink, she did it. So many destroyers. Nice. Tornado will actually really helped me in this fight. Because it slows down all these melee units. See how different that was. Still might end up losing, but not bad. It's close. Much closer than it has been in the past. Better get that mana shield on. Priests are coming in with a heal. Very nice. Well, I've worked on some knights. But there's only so much you can do. I've not got a really... I mean, the hippo riders are good, but... I've not got enough of a decent squad. My, my early game is good, not my mid to late game I don't think is as great. I don't think I got terrible units, but it's not like the most popping stuff. Very popping. This could work. Yeah. If, we get, if we just get one good snowball. The idea is it's just going to like one shot the base. Right, what's my other hero going to be? Ooh, that's not bad. That will help. Let's get another knight. Get some armor. I think I need to finish up upgrading the uh, stats on the army. I normally upgrade the stats earlier, but I've not done it this time. She's already used the tornado. Maybe I should have turned it off. Oh dear, that's not good. She's miles away. Can you stop using tornado now, please? Oh dear. That does not bode well. Although she might be alive for the next part of the fight, at least. Don't know about the Archmage, though. Poor guy. Oh, that's Invis. Save the day. This is a good way to level up the heroes. Keep them in the game. Still got a bit more to go through. Not 
any upgrades on Ping's army, actually, either. Any invis? Is she still there? She's gonna die! God. I mean, the Archmage did alright. Got to live a little bit longer than I thought. at the moment. That Archmage probably gets to live. Maybe. Oh no, that's a shame. Well, he did what he could. Warden's still going there. He might want to start getting items for that Warden actually. I don't know, she's going to hit level 10. I don't really get to fight. Well, actually, I do get to fight against the destroyers. I can deal with the destroyers with my hippo riders. I'd say we're losing at the moment, but it will just come down to one last final push. If we can get like one push back, that'd be great. My Archmage is still only level 2 though. Needs to somehow stay alive longer. The world always puts Yellow's army in a bad position. Tyro's only got one one upgrade, so before you go and say you need specific upgrades to win, well, I've got free free now, so let's see. Good art. Sucks about that Priestess of the Moon. Although my healing ward is a good counter to that. As good a counter as you're going to get, apart from Stump or something. Not going to be much left to fight back with, boys. Look at that sea bitch. She'd just be popping up. I think I got more teams or something. Some sort of DPS. See where you go for more team. They've had the gold point. They've had the middle for so long now. I really need to turn that tornado off. This is a better arc. We've still got to go against Chichop after this. Shell probably ain't that expensive. 50 gold. Oh, 
more priests. Priests everywhere. I suppose I should get some fairy dragons now. We'll be at this all day. This is the snowball. This is it now, boys. Yeah, I was thinking of buying some items for my um, Naga Sea Bitch soon. Oh, keep the Archman. Oh, man. He always kind of just dies here. Start for again. Mm, we're gonna have to somehow survive. What's coming next? Can I help you? Hello. Where's the endurance? to get the range. I got mostly range. Don't really have items on their heroes. Webcam is doing what it needs to do. If not, I need to put the light on. The trust in the webcam. I might get a second hero and another aura item. Third hero, sorry. Oh, I didn't turn it off in time, but it will do, actually. It's a big fight. He gets tornado as well. Second tornado, there you go. Just about being kept alive by the priests. Yeah, I can do it. Appreciate that. I'll turn one of those tornadoes off. I don't know, I think they're both casting it. So they might have cast it before I or whatever. Long range on it.
Wait, what are you doing with Volcano over here? <laughs> are you tinkering? Yeah, that was probably the worst Volcano I think I've ever seen. I don't know if you need Glaive upgrade. There's five Huntresses. So unless I want to go mass Huntresses. I think we need more on Holy Frenzy now, looking at it. I got a lot of necromancers, huh? There should be an unholy frenzy everything. More gold is required. much back and forth at the moment, we've just been getting beaten for ages. I think that's it. Maybe a volcano would be good here. He's not doing volcano though now. It would be perfect time for a volcano. Wow, well, that fire lord really sucks. Probably the worst fire lord ever. Well, I blame my team. Okay, let's see. I'll do my old school strat, going straight for the hero and no unit at the start. Bloody. I got hippo rise again, which is good, but. There's still no big boy, there's no frostworm, there's no chimera, so I can't carry. Obsidian statues are good though. Yeah, I'd say this is pretty mediocre for the most part. I've got some good auras though. I mean, you got like Kodo, you got obsidian statue. Yeah, that's kind of it though, really. Mm. Yep. Not so good. Maybe you should be able to re-roll or something, it should cost you gold to re-roll a row or something. Do you want to re-roll the top row? Do you want to re-roll the mid row? Re-roll the bottom row? Rifles are always pretty consistent all the way through the game, so you can make a lot of them and there's not much punishment for it. But yeah, I'd like some priests really. Priest, please. Let's see if they got any better units. No, the units look kind of shite as well, to be honest. Oh dear. We didn't get any frost ones or any chimeras, so I think we've lost again. Don't think you can really rush this map, can you? Reroll kind of beats the purpose. Not if it costs you gold. There's not much point having a build set for you that you can't change that is terrible. Because that's not entertaining either, is it? Demon Hunter is going to be hard to break at the start. Dark range is pretty good, I think. Your life drain, probably. Although I need to choose when, when to use it. Oh god, they got pillowed. That's the way. Yeah, I'm gonna get absolutely annihilated there. The Lord's too fucking strong. That oh, shit. Bike drain, though. 
actually could have done the second one. I don't know if I win that. I'll have to sacrifice a third gold mine just so I can try to win that. I'll put down as much DPS as possible. And then go for the third gold mine. It does depend on the suck, yes. Job done. My bow is ready. Go. She is the tank, yep. No chance to lose this next fight now. I can get one try just to slow the enemy hero in his auto attacks. Wow. Oh yeah, I'm gonna win this. If I fucking lose this, that'll be a joke. Can't really make her tank there very easily because the units just jump in front. This is actually close, which is kind of disgusting. Black arrows is shank. It'll be all right if I can trust, but I think it's going to hit the pit lord first. I'm expecting her to hit the pit lord first, typically. I don't know if it works in this, but you can get skeletons off of life drain as well. Stick her in front. Might even have to get like a footman or something just to stop them from going for my range units. I never get banshees, do I? I think it might be worth trying to give her items, actually. The quicker she can get to level 6, the quicker she can steal units, which is kind of effectively like building another unit anyway. So the money you're spending on the unit item to keep her alive, you're kind of like building that unit with charm. I'll get damage upgrade and armor upgrade. Bit early, but I couldn't buy the item in time. Typically the health item. The health item is not even too bad because she can suck it all back. That is the gimpiest, ugliest butt looking ghoul ever. Butt face ghoul. Why do we have all the darkness? I guess. Definitely unusual. I'm just going to go for a second hero, honestly, already, but no. Demon Hunter's strong early, so yeah. I'm gonna suck him off there.
should have enough time to get another suck. Bounce a giant string. She was almost about to do another suck there. Don't have anything good against the pit law, that's the problem. This stuff kind of sucks. I'm not even sure disease cloud will work against him. Maybe rifleman and mass damage. Probably get range. Go for tier two, get the range. Soften up the pit, Lord. The spell breakers don't do well against huntresses. They don't really do well against pit, Lord, either. Kind of weak units, really. You only want to get them when the enemy have got too many casters. Some pretty good units there. It's probably a reduced magic item, yeah. Don't know, that's different enough at the moment. I get all the stuff that. Oh, yeah, that definitely looks different enough. Could have had that in the other one. Should equip it, right? The ones that I've got. If I can. Oh. Tier 3. Oh, yeah. Bit cheeky. Chieftains are always bloody good. The abomination rifleman upgrade, I think. Died just in time. Of 
crazy tank in between. That's the Blitzkrieg tank. Admiral Proudmore, man. Tyrion Fordering. Emperor. Oh, shit. Judgment Paladin. Sick. It's Heroes of the Storm. Looking oofer there. Get another son. It's got a lot of abominations. Hydra Monsters, cool, for 50. Like purple Archmage. The Bishop's good with the hair. I like the purple, but I think the overall bishop is better. With like the whole horse and the regalia. Demon Hunter burned too hot. Too early. I haven't got the rifle upgrade yet. No. I can do that when the units are moving after you've already built, because it's only 75 gold. So we can put down as much as this as possible. Short puzzle, man. I would do Nazgrel. I don't know if today's a good day for it though. There we go. Wow, they're at our base already. Oh, my hippos are going to go all the far ahead. That's a bit of a shame. But my god. Can't even hang out in there. going on? What is going on? Getting the right units. I just assume this is going to do the trick. Yeah, they're not great in this, but they are the logical pick.
They'll have to be. They're only 65 gold each. She's still level 4. I'm getting a bit fucked up because I can't fight this with my whole army. Gyros then, I guess. We'll chuck those in as well. Although, uh, last time I checked, gyros were quite bad in this, typically. They cost twice as much as a hippogriff. This looks more one-sided than the previous game. Hippos a bit further ahead in case there's any bounce. Oh, got level six in that dreadnought. Demon hunter. Go anti air, go. Anti air, jump down. I've been trying to get fast level 6, but the enemy team all got level 6 before, yeah. <sighs> I've run out of mana. I want the TC to die so I get experience on the Dark Ranger. to get rid of some of those bats before my army turns up. Finally, I got charm. Will I have enough mana to actually cast it? She's dead anyway. And she doesn't come with this army. Right. Time to win the air control. I got two free armor upgrades. He's got only three zero on attack. No way I'll lose this time. That's actually disgusting. Oh, I guess riflemen then. Unless you just build like nothing but gyros. Yeah, I got the gyro upgrade. It's already got flank cannon. I wonder if there's a Sobe mask. I think that would be good for my hero.
Might be able to get the final upgrade on attack damage as well by the time I get over here. Whoa, we still haven't got that fucking tower down yet. Volcano. Off we go. Yeah, she needs mana. Well, she's got mana, actually, she's okay. Look at all the fucking charms. Don't need to use life drain because we're going to burn through her mana if she can stay alive passively anyway. I mean, you could get more heroes, but the funny thing is, is really the priority is her. The higher level she is, the more mana she gets back from Sobi Mask, because her intelligence stats will be higher. So it might be worth putting points into stats, so she can keep casting charm for as long as possible. As long as she just keeps staying alive. So I'd actually prioritize attribute bonus here. Still going. Might be worth using a life drain now. At least the demon hunter. Down for the count. Might need to get an aura now, actually, for the next run. Any auras? No aura enjoyers, just orb enjoyers. I've got Kodo and I. Less war drums though. Two Sobi. Double Sobi would be nice, but I think she kind of lives as long as she does. Yeah, you could turn off Dark Arrow as well. Mountain giants are bloody nice. I don't think they have that many casters still. Rifles now, pumping damage. Didn't steal the Camaro. I'm gonna wipe out as much of this as I can. Me against the world, boys. See you later, Ryan. Don't know if I need to start getting some hippo riders, actually. Be like kind of another range unit. I can fit in. You want to get all the cascades of range. So like 400, 500, 600 sort of behind each other. And air range as well. Anyone sleepy in chat? Anyone like the video yet? It's done that before. Drop the item.
Just in time. Okay, let's annihilate this army. Let's deal with it. Get it out of here. Let's go, boys. Give me a frost worm. Oh, went for a hippo rider. I'm fighting back. Even with his double hero, I'm like, nah, get the hell out. Get the hell out. And that was killing the units beforehand as well. It's alright. People will come over to twitch.tv slash witty and they'll subscribe there and donate and uh, follow the channel. So I'm okay. Yeah, I think I just have to throw Hippo Riders in. There's no re roll option. You still look at that mana regen. I'll turn off the black arrows now. I'll get the improved bows and the marksmanship. We are close to their base, so flying machine bomb is possible, but I'll still wait on that. Oh, I should definitely get the war drums. I should have got that before. God damn! Volcano saying no! The charm, did Charm turn the game around? I don't know if you can give all the credit to Charm, but... Yeah, yeah. Man, look at that score. Doing what we can. Right. What will my hero be this time? Female Demon Hunter? Female Tauren Chieftain? Female Blade Master? Yes, the next game. This game is the deciding game. What did I get? Ooh! A combine. Ooh! So, oh, I got good units this time. Not really many... Um, caster units like if I had necromancers that would be really del delicious for Unholy Frenzy but I will take what I've got if other people have got like shamans and stuff that would be good good there's a shaman there mm, no necromancer I don't think there priest there chimeras Yep. Yuppers. Was that a huntress? Still got these items to pick up. Mass possess and anti-magic shell. Force them to, into building terrible units. Don't tell them that I have a banshee. They don't stream snipe at the moment, so we're safe. They'll, they'll never know. Alchemist, be nice. I don't think you can ever nerf Banshee. Do -do. They got Torn Chieftain again, kind of annoying. They keep getting Torn Chieftain. 
Blood Mage is okay. Certainly not bad. Not as good as some though. Dirty pigeon. Thank you very much there for the sub. Hello. I wonder if I should just tech. Tech for bear. Get some master bears. Because I think he's not going to do very well at the moment. He's not even cast a flame strike. You could fucking kill one unit with a flame strike, bro. Get the gold mine. It's alright. I'll let them take the hit this time. Because last time I tried to prioritize leveling up my Dark Ranger and she was one of the last ones to get level 6 anyway, so it's a bit like Legion TD and trying to kill level 10. So I think I might even get level a higher level on my Blood Mage if I just go for bears straight away. Because they're bloody good in this. How we doing? Check it out. If I'm lucky, my hero might just be able to follow behind someone else, but not likely. You know, you can get a fiend. There's some deeps. Whilst I'm waiting. Not going to be much cop. I won't do well first as that. Right, you got bar. I assume you need tier three for the master bear. There, can you do a flame strike, please? That would be nice if you could pop in and do one of those. Sure don't. If I turn it off and then turn it on mid-fight, he might do it. Druid of the Claw Master Training, and that is probably going to be tier 3, let's face it. So I might want to upgrade tier 3 first. You can sort of say that you have to do it either way. Oh, I guess you do. Yeah, they definitely do. Tier 3. Maybe I'll go double bear first then, and then tech. Orange for sure. Actually, have any anti caster? Maybe I can kill this though. Maybe. Don't know. It's kind of scary and kind of cute. Will I get the experience? The answer is no. Thank you, Taylor. You got a serpent ward. It's happening. Time for a flame strike. Let's go. It's gonna do it. Three, two, one. He actually might kill that shadow hunter. He's gonna do it. What about us? Don't need a flame strike. Flame strike overrated. Why the fuck do you get that many units? Is he using some sort of cheat or are they giving him gold? Hmm. I'll get one abomination as well for disease cloud. See ya! Uh, I'm gonna have to put the budgies away to bed tonight. I'm the only one in the house. Filthy budgies.
See, I'm holding on to those. I'm not using those yet. It's like my trump card. Don't want to expose them. Don't let them kill the tower. I think I got experience. I'm not sure. No, maybe not, because I would have got that experience probably from killing the Shadow Hunter. Ah, there we go. I don't think he's tier 3, because he's got a lot of units. So he's, got to be, I don't know, he's still no flame fucking strike. So my hero is absolutely useless. I think my best bet is possibly Hippo Riders, actually. I wouldn't mind Camaros. Camaros won't do much against Wyverns. Dragon Hall Rider, maybe. A couple of those bad boys. Just to mess with the Wyverns. That's if they can live. I don't know. I don't take the budgies up into my rear. They get bored otherwise. They don't understand a computer. So good here. Here we go. We're definitely gonna get flame strike now. He actually did it. Kind of bad, but he still did it. At least that's triggered his memory. I lost my dragon hawk riders to counter Chichoff there. I kind of wish this fight would last a bit longer because Chichoff's gonna arrive in a moment. I'm just gonna suicide into it. Here we go. Right, I'm just going to have to mass banshees now. I can't really hold on to it. That's my trump card anymore. Whatever. Oh no, so many... Blood mages. It's not looking. Fortune is not looking favorable. They got panda as well. They got way better heroes in all these games, by the way. I can move them further back, but they're pretty quick with their possession. Can't really possess anything good against Tyrell then. Still have to get Master Bears, don't I, as well? Oh, hey, look at that flame strike. Oh, wait, sorry, I did get Master Bears, my bad. Alright, now we get the Banshee, because. Pig. Devo, he's got to go now. I don't know. The only unit I can think of that does well against Chichos army is the Hippo Rider, from what I've got. It's the only unit that doesn't suck. Obviously, you've got white fiends and that. They might just get possessed though. My cheapest unit is a Huntress, so...
XD. You get master necromancers. Except they all just die for some reason. I guess that's how the banshees work, maybe. I'm going to get raw. Dunno, did they have the frenzy on? Wait, they cast Roar anyway, don't they? I don't have to get like a separate upgrade for that. Yeah, there we go. Got a Roar. They're definitely losing health over time after possessing. So it does look like they've been nerfed a bit. Blood Mage has been absolutely useless there. It's almost worth getting a second hero, actually. Just because the Blood Mage ain't doing shit. Devo just got destroyed. We might not even live that long, to be honest. Man, this was even... It got more one-sided, kind of, as it went. <laughs> even though we did get a win on that second game. I'm not sure how long he went AFK for, but... Oof. Well... What can you do? I think they got incredibly lucky with their heroes. I don't think they ever had a bad hero, did they, on their side? What's with this damage done as well? Sometimes it almost felt like there was some sort of bug where they were getting more gold or something. I mean, they were, kind of, from the middle, but that was still an early game. I don't know. 